Take him outside, see if he gets sleepy. Get him some sun. She's either peeing or going to sleep. <laughs> oh, where's where's he going? Where's brother? I'm gonna take him outside. There we go. Sweet. It's okay. You don't have to start crying because he stopped crying. He's like, oh, my turn. My turn to get attention and cry. This is Fire Junior. Fire Junior. That's why Cinder. Oh, uh, that's true. Yeah. It does what kind of work there. See? Cinder. She looks just like Fire Daddy. She it's really does. Video. You're sliding. Uh-oh. Are you getting sleepy, little one? I need to put my pizza. Uh, do you sure you don't need a pillow? I can get you a pillow. Would you be there's, weird? There's one. Would you be yeah. Would you be weird? No, Absolutely. You have always been weird. What are you talking about? Oh, here, by the way, people have been, oh, uh, just for the Heidi Nail fan club. I haven't had them done in three weeks. <laughs> Quit it. Oh. Little leg stretch. Little leg stretch. Oh, bubbles. Is that your baby? How do they do out here? Oh, uh, they've really been out. Oh, that, yeah. Hey, Booger, you need to stay in the grass. Yeah. Come here. Let's go out here. There you go. Taking them out, ramming them around, hopefully tucker them out. Also, get them accustomed to just being outside. Sights and sounds and smells and stuff. Things like that are important. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Look at this little, look at this brave little guy. I just don't want him to get to the pool. Oh, excuse me. Oh my gosh, bubbles. Hey, bubbles. There you go. Bubbles, bubbles. <laughs> bubbles. It's like he doesn't like, uh, doesn't want baby to be outside for too long. If you if you could feel just how stout like little ones even are, they're just their bundles a little muscle. So, yeah, they're they're okay. Reset. Skatoosh. Come get them. <laughs> Pumples. And yeah, it's it's very important. I. Uh, and the way that, that Bubs has been with the little ones, it's super important to continue to kind of let them... Bubby, go get your baby! To let them kind of have their dynamic okay. and explore that dynamic, especially as they get older. Because they're going to get older and older and older, and their abilities are going to very, very rapidly improve. And they're going to be able to uh, put a lot of hurt and damage onto Bubs. And it's important that Bubs is able to express to them in no uncertain terms early on and get them to believe that like hey i'm basically i'm mom i'm top dog and you gotta listen to me which is important it really is really really is come on baby hmm? go up the stairs come on 
What good tiger? You can do it. Up here. Come on, baby. You can do it. Need a little assistance. Well, we got a cat. Uh oh. Come here. There you go. Good job. Come on, baby. This way. Okay, so Gibbs is basically just laying on top of Heidi right now. <laughs> Two little ones back inside. They ate. They've been playing, and it's probably going to be nap time very, very soon. Like pass out time. Whoa! Whoa! Pass out time is going to be happening very rapidly. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Yeah. All right. All right. Well, that's, I think, probably a good place to end it. Probably a good place to end it. I'm going to have to go and do some more filming stuff because I only got one day here. I got to get going. Oh, they might start snuggling up with each other. All right. We'll keep going just for a little bit longer. That's okay with everyone. Oh, the almost touched the baby. Oh, pubs. I'm also the first thing he tried to poop out there. The moment I sat him down, he tried to poop. Good spot. Now it's probably. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So you got 20 minutes going on right now. I've been doing these 10 minute casts. I could probably break it up into two separate casts. Oh my gosh. Big brain. I'm so smart. Are you are you trying to keep that fly away from those babies? He's been running around snapping at the air trying to keep a fly away from the little ones. <laughs> I would have won. I would have won. That is my toes. Chew on this. No, no, no. You chew on this. No chewing on toes. You chew on stuffies. You think it, is that scale would it would it handle both of us? Yeah. Okay. Really? Oh wow. Okay. Yeah. Because Gibbs is going to be over a hundred, and I weigh about two forty, something like that. All right.
Yeah. I don't have any more. I'm sorry. Yeah, Yeah. Time for night night. Sleep, sleep. Sleep, sleep. Sleep, sleep. Sleep, sleep. Sleep, sleep. Um, oh, I, oh. There we go. See? There we go. I'm gonna like hold him underneath the armpits. So you can kind of simulate that. <laughs> you can kind of simulate that kind of mom, that mom kind of picking them up kind of thing. Oh wait, that's right. They're, I keep on forgetting. We move their little, we move their little kind of playpen, sleep, sleep, sleep area from the uh, the office and into the uh, into the back of the house. So, okay, so now we're gonna take that, and that little one is gonna go right in there. Hey, little sleepy guy. <laughs> oh, goodness, oh, goodness. That got you all just sorts of, all sorts of snoozy, didn't it? All sorts of snoozy. Good boy. Okay, so we gotta do this thing. There we go. And then there's one, and then there's the other. And then the next feeding time is going to be, when is that? Five. Five. All right. Night-night, babies. I know, Deb's dealing with all those babies. It's very sleep, sleepfulness-inducing. It's tough work being an uncle. He says they're just dumb. <laughs> he says those babies are dumb. I said, I'm no, Gibson. honestly, he says, I'm the baby. I'm about to have a birthday in a couple of days, and nobody, mm -hmm. nobody is worried about me. No one is worried just about Gibson, just those yes, dumb babies. <laughs> oh. All right. Thanks for watching this episode of the Walker on the Compound webcast. Hashtag Dorbus Award in the comment section below. Like and subscribe for all your big uh, goodness. And if you want to learn more about the facility, you can always check out the website, carerescuetexas.com. And... We'll see you later. All right. Bye-bye.